Owen Wilson channels his inner Bob Ross with this fictional comedy, Paint. I got to watch Paint before it's released in theaters, and I really hope no one sleeps on this because it's just so great. Owen Wilson plays a famous painter named Carl Nargle, who's basically a more narcissistic version of Bob Ross. He has the afro, the painting, the gentle whisper of a voice, but he was also obsessed with people being obsessed with him, and Owen Wilson was perfect for that. Wilson does that kind whisper voice really well, but a lot of the acting was on his face. So even though Carl Nargle would say, oh, everything is okay. You can clearly see how everything is not okay, and that added a lot of depth to his character. Carl Nargle would come off as this sweet, loving man, but in reality, he was so insecure and he would take advantage of people. But because Owen Wilson plays this character so well, I couldn't dislike him. I was like one of Carl Nargle's fans, just constantly making excuses for him. Like, he legit had me mind controlled for a second. It was incredible. Dare I say, this might be some award-winning acting from Owen Wilson. Wow. Pain is also a very funny movie, but in a subtle way. Much like its main character, the comedy is calm on the surface. Like, there's not a lot of crazy antics, because it's all in the dialogue. These characters say crazy things, but they deliver it in a way that sounds so natural, and then other characters react to it in such a normal fashion that I don't catch it at first. And it's not until a couple seconds later where I'm like, wait, what the heck did they just say? And I start cracking up. There's a part where Carl Nargle is seducing this woman, and he just goes, would you like to feel my sandals? What? And the woman is like, Oh yes, Carl. I was just like, what in God's name is happening right now? It's like, it's so weird, but everyone's acting so normal about it. It's just, it's just funny. And I really appreciate that Paint has a runtime of an hour and a half, because it's a character-driven movie, and usually those run a bit long, even the good ones. This, however, is just like, hey, watch this guy be funny and learn stuff. Okay, bye. And I'm like, thank you, movie. It never felt rushed. All the characters are developed in a reasonable way. The comedy wasn't becoming annoying. Like, paint doesn't overstay its welcome. It tells the story and then it dips. Sometimes an hour and a half is just the uh, perfect runtime for a movie. Paint releases in theaters on April 7th, so make sure you don't miss this movie. I think you're gonna be pleasantly surprised like I was. Paint is a fun ride that leaves you excited for more, like a roller coaster. Another movie based on a lovable celebrity that I think you should watch is A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood starring Tom Hanks. Check out my review on it by clicking on the box right here. And if you enjoyed this review and you want to see more, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss anything new. And I'll see you in a bit.